Good morning, guys. So I am getting blood taken. Um, I just need to have my like handful of levels um, checked. So that is where we're going, and then take a wild guess to where we are going after that. Be careful. There's this. It is just about 9 p.m. and I went MIA for most of the day because I had to get um, uh, blood work done. Um, and we came back and hung out for a while and then I just was like, this is not happening. So I went into bed and was just trying to watch a show I've been watching and ended up falling asleep like twice. Um, the show is amazing. I'll have to. Uh, I'll have to let you guys know how I feel about it when I'm done with watching. But um, if you, if I hadn't said anything or you didn't hear uh, anything from you about what it's about, um, it's about the town that, or the city, um, that was like the crime central of the entire country. And, um, you know, at some point they didn't even have like fresh water, you know, no no uh, adequate wa water available to them, very bad situation, and they were able to kind of put a specific um, police force to do certain things um, to try to reverse some of the damage and um, reverse some of the, um, the hatred that's going on with, uh, between people and police officers and stuff. So. So it's really interesting to see about like what they're changing around to try to make um, even just relationships between the community and like police officers a little bit better. Um, so I definitely recommend it. Uh, it's really, really good. And um, we saw in the news tonight too that in, I don't remember where it was, I don't know if it was in New York or New Jersey, I don't remember where it was, but basically, um, instead of giving a, tip, a ticket um, to somebody who has a broken um, like light on their car, they'll um, give a voucher for them to get the thing fixed and I guess get it fixed for free so that, you know, it's not like I'm pulling you over, making you pay something and then forcing you to go pay for like, to get the piece fixed. Piece fixed. And uh, they're also talking about giving like little treats out to kids, and they just want to foster like better, um, a better relationships, a better relationship with the community and the police officers and crime and everything. So it's really good they were able to get. It. I think I said this that they were able to get their crime down 40 percent, which is incredible. Um, so I'm hoping that this is the beginning of something that's going to be like, you know, ongoing, so that we can like try to, you know, clean some of the damage that, you know, has been going on super, so recently with everything. But anyway, so, sorry for the long um, spiel about random stuff, but I've just been, like, watching that today, and um, I took a nap earlier, I just took medication, and so I've just kind of been chilled out um, all day, so that's basically what I've done, <laughs> um, and Adrian will be coming probably in the next, like, We'll probably leave in like 20 minutes ish. And then um, I'll be at his house until the usual, which I believe is Monday. So, hey guys. And I gotta also show you um, my mandala too, because I haven't shown you guys that either. So, I will see you guys soon. It's crazy. So, it's raining right now, but like looking straight, it's pouring like torrential. It doesn't even look like it's raining at all. There's this whole like crisis thing that's going on where um, something with the pump, I think, for the pool was undone or something like that. Um, so everybody's like trying to get everything together with that and making sure everything is okay. Um, his mom made really good soup. Um, she's really great at soups. The like vegetables are cooked all the way, so it's easier, easier for me to eat, but it's like um, a steak soup. So I just take it without the steak. Um, and it's really good. So, 
I took Zofran, um, I've barely, I really haven't even eaten today, I've been so nauseous the past two days. Um, so I'm just kind of slowly trying to eat the um, soup, and then I think I'm going to start messing around with my watercolor paints, but um, just got to figure out, I guess, what's going on with this stuff outside. It's like 11, 11.30, I think, 11.30 probably, so I don't understand what's going on, though, and I hope he treats okay. <laughs> Because they're like trying to help him out. I don't know. So, are we going to sleep? I am just reading my book. Adrian's reading his. Ugh. And we're, yeah, we're about to go to sleep. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching, even though today has been a bit boring. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching, everybody.